pulled it out of the water. He probably sees the gator. Oh, he sees everything. Oh, That's yeah. why he yeah. sees the fish. He's, He's so flying cool. around like, yeah, I don't think I'll yeah. land here. Oh, There's a gator God, in the... I'm doing a show for those people today. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know what I learned today? I, I well, I don't know. He might come this. in for a the landing. The reason an owl can turn his head all the way around like this and everything, it's because their eyeballs take up three quarters of their head, and their eyeballs can't move. Their eyeballs don't move in the oh, socket. Really? So that's why they turn their head. Yep. Huh. I've learned that on TV today. <laughs> and it wasn't on YouTube. <laughs> it wasn't on YouTube, huh? No. Their what eyeballs was it are on? so big, that's why... It what was it on? Discovery Channel? One of those things. One of them. Talking about animals. bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time it's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can sit together it's so beautiful, you and me, we meant to be, in the great outdoor, oh, get goes up here, forever free, I know, <laughs> there's so much wildlife in this little area, what are you doing over here Scott, are you getting yourself in trouble? Well, I helped him put the table together. Oh, pretty. And, and now we're putting chairs together. Oh. But I realized that, see, I, so I drank my coffee, but then it came time to start baking, so I figured I'd still, <laughs> still one of the beers. <coughs> well, it is. He needs to stay hydrated because yeah. he's working so hard. Right. Well, it is afternoon. It is. I think it is. It's yeah. 12.31. Yeah. And soon. it's 5 o'clock somewhere, so it's okay. Did you change already? <laughs> yes. So oh yeah, because it's daylight savings time. Right. So Shelly and Russell just moved into this beautiful house here, and you've been how long you been in? Just a, a, month. a month. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Look at this. So pretty. The golf course is right over there. Yeah. And then those pelicans that you guys were seeing, they are. <laughs> <laughs> it's a gated community. Don't don't dox them. <laughs> Here, I'm gonna go show them your beautiful bedroom. So they have been putting furniture together. They've got boxes all over the place because they're they're just trying to get everything set up. They went to Paris uh, this last year, and Shelly took all these pictures. Really pretty. So she's decorating with all of her own photographs. So this is just a huge house. Really big. Walk in shower. Woo wee. Well, they, they what can they get away with? Person. Yeah, they made a ruling that the FCC did not. I'm going to take them upstairs. <laughs> You're what? <laughs> Your hoarding room. <laughs> oh, this is just gorgeous. Really pretty view. Of course, this is a lot that's going to get a house built on it, so they won't have the view of that river. Pretty. She's really got some beautiful paintings. This is their hoarding room. 
So they moved from South Carolina, so she's just got all her stuff that she's got to go through. And this will be our guest room next year when we come to visit. Really nice. All right, that's the tour of their new home. You know, your steps are really nice because they're really wide. They're easy to walk down. Yeah, they are easy to walk down. Yeah. Boxes and boxes and boxes. And more boxes. And more boxes. See where they put them at. Seven and three. Yeah, they're really wide. They're nice. Seven, seven, eight. Oh. And I think there's more than normal number of steps for us because the house is so Yeah, it's, there's a lot of stairs. Oh, yeah. Well, you got to get up that 10 foot ceiling. <laughs> yep. Yeah. All right, so we're just hanging out for the day. Aja has moved on. She is going to meet us down the road because she wanted to go do some hiking and some other stuff. <clears throat> so we're uh, we're going to hang out here for another day, and then uh, we'll get back on the road and meet up with Aja. What is Uncle Russ telling you? I can't find the Tide Pod thing that I brought in. It's lost, and he told me. I think he ate the Tide Pod. <laughs> Kids, do not eat the Tide Pod. <laughs> they're not healthy cool. for you. Not, I, don't, I don't know where it went. The Tide Pod thing is done. But, it was a stupid thing. What are you doing? You're doing some laundry. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 I'm not going to walk outside to find the Tide Pod. Uh, oh, yeah. I don't know where yeah. they are. Because you probably did. You probably ate it. <laughs> yeah, like you were... <laughs> too much alive. Yeah. That stuff happens to me all the time. I lose my thumb, I lose. I know. Um, this is what happens. <laughs> we come here and Scott's got to work. <laughs> I don't mind. I work for food. <laughs> oh, that's going to look nice there. Yeah. yeah. This is a place. Yeah. See, this is an olive tree. Did you know that? This is from an olive tree. Okay. That's from that's that's from the house. These yeah. are both from Spain. Yeah. From when I was a little kid. From the Scotty and Shelly's mama and dad's. Yeah, cool. <laughs> yeah, that's Scott. So Shelly has been over here cooking. Oh, she made vodka pasta. Yum. I know that that's a little gator to you guys, but I've never seen one in the wild before. It's pretty exciting for me. We're all out here having lunch. I think you smelled my french fries. <laughs> I want to see if I can get down here close to him. Oh, he's gone. That was it. He won't come back up, huh? Oh, yeah. Maybe the um, maybe the golf cart scared him. Yeah, I think he's gone. But boy, that was really cool. Got to see my first gator. Ooh, that was exciting. That is the first, I mean, that was a performance for you because that's the first one we've seen you. Yeah, that was really fun. That's crazy. He's, still he's big gator. enough. <laughs> yeah, he's still he's a little over three feet, I would say. Yeah, he's probably about three feet. It's cruising. 
I don't know. He's longer than he. Oh, now I can see. Oh, now he's really getting up there. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's, he's a lot long. longer than ah, what we are seeing. Yeah, he's probably four feet. Well, look at him. He wants to come over here and have some lunch with to, us. He wants to have some chicken. Told you. A lot of lunch. Yeah. Phil makes good. He chicken. actually is coming over here. <laughs> Oh no, get out of there, turtle. Get out of there, turtle. Is he a turtle up in front of him? Yeah. yeah. A turtle off to the left. Oh, oh where yeah. that green stuff's at. I see it now. Six feet. I was, I know, that's what I was just thinking, how stealthy yeah, he see was. That big one that With his there. tail, yeah, he's over four feet long. That big one that we had at work in Charleston, he was probably ten feet long. Maybe eight feet long. Somewhere between eight and ten feet. <laughs> 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 Did you guys see that? <laughs> uh, I don't think you're supposed yeah, to supposed bring to the cart down path. there like that. <laughs> it about flung the one guy right out, I think. I missed it. <laughs> <laughs> he did. He bounced. Uh, we got gators. We got pelicans. Mm -hmm. We got stupid golfers. Stupid golfers. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hola, and good morning. So, Shelly and Russ already left. Russ had to go to work. Shelly went to work out. And we're going to get on the road. We're going to get out. Yeah, Shelly Russell, thank you guys so much for your hospitality, taking us to the really cool restaurant with crawfish. That All the crawfish I could eat. Yeah. yeah. I won't need any for a while now. Yeah. And you guys have a beautiful house. So Absolutely. Thank you so much. And we are going to get on the road and go to we're Mississippi. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're not very far from Mississippi. So we're going to go um, over the bridge, get into Mississippi, do a few things uh, right at the border. And then we're going to go find Daja. Yeah. So she's, uh, I think she's at a beach somewhere. Yeah, that's where we're ready to go. Beach! It's been beautiful yeah, here. Yeah. Absolutely. It's really humid, though. Um, more humid than I've ever been in. Even last year when we were uh, in Padre, is Padre, Padre Island. Island. Yeah. And there was another uh, beach that uh, we were at. Crispy Cur Cr Cr yeah. Cream? <laughs> Christy Cur Cor no. Corpus Christi. Yeah. Uh, it was not this humid when we were here last, or not not in Louisiana, but when we were in Texas. Yeah. It was not this humid at all. So this is a little bit of getting used to. It's really hot in the camper at nighttime. Um, to have the windows open, it's kind of, you get really damp in there. So it's kind of something to think about if you're going to travel to a state that has a really high humidity because when you're in a camper or a trailer, if you don't, if you can't run your air conditioning all night long, it can get very, <laughs> And it's very messing with my hair. Dang, it's humidity. Yeah. Yeah. It's, <laughs> yeah, it's a little, it makes you a little fuzzy. <laughs> a little curly. I have natural curly hair and I straighten it, but it's a little, a little kinky. So. We're getting ready to leave. Yeah. And thanks right. again so much, Shell and Russ, for, uh, letting us stay here and honestly um whether you let us or not i was going to st stay in your <laughs> front yard anyways <laughs> yeah all right well i hope you guys enjoyed the time that we were here and we're gonna get get, get on the road and we've seen lots of wildlife right in their backyard yeah they've already and seen it they seen the gator yeah oh <laughs> I thought it was. He doesn't. He doesn't pay attention to editing. <laughs> no, no, too much work again. But it was kind of funny because I was looking out there and um, I was like, "That's not a stick that's moving like that." And he was. That's cool. He looked smaller than he actually was. I think he ended up being like four and a half, five feet. It was a. It was big. Big for us and everything. Maybe not big for some people, but we've never seen one out in the wild, so that was really cool. Yeah. Uh, that's. I've. I have gotten more. I've check marked more things off of my bucket list in Louisiana than I have in any other state. Is the Grand Canyon right around the corner? We could knock that one out. 
No. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm pretty excited about that. I need to look at my bucket list again and see what else I can knock off of there. Yeah, because you had a bucket full of crawdads. I did. That's a I did. Of. That was so good. Those little crawdads, they were spicy, though. They had yeah. a lot of cayenne in them. I make crawfish at home, um, but I do not. I take Obey and add a little bit of cayenne back into that mix, but not as hot as that. But it was really, awesome. Yeah, it was really good. Now so, I'm hungry for more. Yeah. I was kind of thinking we were going to have to say, come on, ice cream in the morning after eating those, because they, they were hot. hot. No. <laughs> <laughs> they, weren't, they weren't that hot, though. Okay, we're going to get on the road. I'm the we, we got to get going, so we'll take you guys with us.